Okay, we've got the new fridge and um, just as I said we're going to replace it because when the solar panels were replaced I think it was a good idea to, to replace the old um, fridge which is probably about 10 years old anyway so um, yeah it just seemed like a good time you know do the electrical things and uh, make it just more you know a, a fresh fresh set of um, stuff I guess so um, this is the uh, this is the new one it's called an RK Shoreline RK 113 and it's a it's a little fridge it's got a little freezer little fridge freezer I guess it is so I open it up have a little look inside it so you've just got normal fridgy stuff you've got three shelves of in the door um, for your milk and bits of tins and stuff and uh, so it's fairly spacious I think it could have I think you know the um, the old one was slightly bigger but um, let's have another look at this I suppose we've got the um, vegetable tray at the bottom here which um, you can actually feel the cold coming out of this one, which is much much better than the old one. You couldn't really feel a lot when you open the door. You just see so we can see the thermometer, which is kind is kind of um, not going to focus on that, is it? Doesn't like it. Doesn't like the white of the of the thermometer. Won't focus on it. So focuses on the red. So you can see it's sort of around the optimum level. Um, which isn't too bad, it's going up quite quickly now, but it's sort of around the optimum level and that's, if you can see, it's on about 3 there so it cools quite well at 3 and it um, the, it seems to draw up we've got a little freezer, freezer part here and the freezer's just got the ice and um, some, uh, some fish fingers from our sandwiches um, so yeah much much cooler I think um, and the running time I'd say probably about 30% the, the other one was on it seems to be on all the time I mean it used to worry me the amount of time that it did spend just um, with the compressor running which was I suppose it's just slightly annoying really when you're sitting in here and the fridge is Sort of going and going and going and going, and you um, and I suppose you wonder when it, I suppose that one is kind of cooling to the same degree, but it's on thirty. Yeah, it's on thirty percent of the time, and so yeah, more effective. A little bit smaller, as you can see, not quite as big, and more or, as. It's, as I say, it's just come out of the marina, so we're not connected to the um, not connected to the shoreline anymore, and then we'll get an indication about how much it's um, actually using under 12 volt conditions. This is this is the um, this is the voltmeter under here. I don't know if you can see that, but it's uh, it's got 12.2, um, which considering the battery's on 12.5, then that's only 0.3. Um, the draw off on the fridge is only 0.3 of a volt which is which is quite a small draw off really um, compared to the last one which used to be about 0.7, 0.8 of, uh, of a volt um, so the the load on the batteries is significantly less and I expect that to make a big difference to the basically to the the whole kind of um, cycle is going to be much more um, efficient I guess I suppose that's um, that additional 0.4 of a volt was just going to um, you know just placing stress on the environment really it's just waste wasted 0.7 of a volt wasted so yeah um, 
looking good so far for the fridge yeah so we'll give it a we'll give it a grade a bit later um, but so far looking quite good